YouTube Chicks <laughs> Get ready You know what to do Chicks so listen, Chicks Smooth Hey Chicks Smooth Appreciate all the coverage that you been doing I've been watching your shit for a while I just subscribed to your shit too bro Oh man Is it finally over for Diddy you guys They just came and got him Now over the last couple of days Diddy has been seen parading the streets of New York <laughs> He's been living his life out and about. He didn't seem like somebody that wanted to flee. And he damn sure was not about to board a plane to Bali. Shout out to Russell Simmons. But tonight, TMC has reported that Diddy has officially been taken into federal custody in New York. According to TMZ, they were told that Diddy was taken to the FBI field office in Manhattan. Homeland Security actually swooped into a Midtown hotel late Monday where Diddy was staying and they arrested him. Now, this is very interesting. Law enforcement also tells TMZ the arrest was actually scheduled for Tuesday, tomorrow. But something happened that caused the feds to move in a day earlier. Hmm, I wonder what that could be. It appears that this was in connection to the ongoing criminal investigation that actually led to search warrants being issued and executed in his homes. Now, Diddy's attorney did speak out. He said, we are disappointed with the decision to pursue what we believe is an unjust prosecution of Mr. Combs by the U.S. Attorney's Office. Sean Diddy Combs is a music icon self-made entrepreneur, loving family man who has spent the last 30 years building an empire, adoring his children, and working to uplift the black community. So it looks like after feds raided Diddy's cribs, they must have found some kind of evidence to bring him in. I know probably earlier this year, it did not seem like this would happen, but we're finally here, people. If there's any updates, I will let you guys know. You guys get in the comments below. Diddy has officially been arrested by the FBI. Push comments below. Scratch my channel like this video. I'll see you guys later, man. So difficult to reflect on the darkest times in your life. But sometimes you got to do that. I was fucked up. I mean, I hit rock bottom. But I made no excuses. My behavior on that video is inexcusable. I take full responsibility for my actions in that video. I'm disgusted. I was disgusted then when I did it. I'm disgusted now. I went and I sought out professional help. I had to go into therapy. I had to go into rehab. I had to ask God for his mercy and grace. I'm so sorry. But I'm committed to be a better man each and every day. I'm not asking for forgiveness. I'm truly sorry.